Hello guys, in today's video I want to show you guys how I'm training to be able to hold my breath longer. We are going to talk about a pyramid table for increasing your tolerance to CO2. It is the buildup of CO2 in your lungs that causes the feeling of need to breathe, not the lack of oxygen. There are many different ways of training and uh, this is just a method I'm using at the moment. So let's just get into it. If you're training in water, never do this alone. We will use a breath hold of one minute as an example. So this is what you do. Lay down on your back or in the pool or wherever you are doing this. Find a comfortable position and try to relax as good as possible. So you breathe for one minute, then you take a deep breath and you hold your breath for 60 seconds. Then you breathe for 50 seconds and you hold your breath for 60 seconds. Then you breathe for 40 seconds and you hold your breath for 60 seconds. So every time you hold your breath, you reduce the resting time with 10 seconds until you only breathe for 10 seconds and hold your breath for 60 seconds. So without stopping, when you get to 10 seconds, you start going reverse in the table. So you breathe for 10 seconds, hold your breath for 60. Breathe for 20 seconds, hold your breath for 60 until you are back at 50 seconds. So in the last one you breathe for 50 seconds and then hold your breath for one minute. So the whole training will look something like this. Breathe for 60 seconds, hold for 60 seconds. Breathe for 50 seconds, hold for 60 seconds. Breathe for 40 seconds, hold for 60 seconds. Breathe for 30 seconds, hold for 60 seconds. Breathe for 20 seconds, hold for 60 seconds. Breathe for 10 seconds, hold for 60 seconds. Breathe for 20 seconds, hold for 60 seconds. Breathe for 30 seconds, hold for 60 seconds. Breathe for 40 seconds, hold for 60 seconds. Breathe for 50 seconds, hold for 60 seconds. And you're done. It's 10 rounds all together. If you think this was easy or too hard, you just adjust the time you're holding your breath to fit your ability. So let's say you think this was very easy, then you just hold your breath for 115 or 130 until you find the level you're comfortable at. I do this training every second day for two weeks, then I swap to a O2 training table for two weeks. I usually will do the same table around three to four times, then I increase the time of holding with 10 or 15 seconds. If I'm training the table and I get to round five and I feel it's too hard, then I won't do the whole table and maybe we'll do only eight rounds. And I will stay on this until I complete the table. So maybe not today, maybe not the next training, but the training after that. If you feel like you're having trouble on round three, then you have chosen a too hard table and should reduce the time of your breath hold. I hope this was helpful. If so, please subscribe to the account and have a nice day.